All right, welcome back to another Let's Play video of Starfield. Yes, oh, it feels so good, bro. I got I got my water bottle, took a nice little hot shower, feeling refreshed, and I'm ready to jump back in here and play some more Starfield, bro. Very, 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 very excited. Man, I've been having Starfield on the brain, man. It's, I've been loving this game again, yo. Ever since the updates and creation club stuff, it's been really, really, really good. But anyway, without further ado, let's jump right into it. So we're still stuck at Neon. We got some some change, but we gotta start saving some money. Yeah. To start saving some money up. All right, let's see. Hold on, let me just make sure I get my mic where it needs to be at. <clears throat> All right, let's go, let's go. See if we can get this job over with. Having survived the perfect marriage here at Stroud Island, we know the power of harmony. Hey there, intrepid explorer. Ready to make your own. Those specs got those two. I don't want that. What are you looking at? I heard one of these missions is going to be bugged because I looked it up and it was bugged. So <clears throat> I'm gonna have to fix that. Are we ready? I'm dreaming of this. <laughs> oh, finally, Briggs is going to let me kick these disciples where it hurts. Oh, I'm happy Dylan too. To let his best man loose for weeks. So thank you for changing his mind. <laughs> you better believe it. The plan's simple. We hit the street runners hard in as many points as possible. Maximum chaos, right? Oh, sounds and like fun. I can waltz into their weapons, cash, snag the big guns, <laughs> and then the real fun begins. Ooh, I really like that. Well, Briggs ain't the only one thinking around here. Here's three groups of street rats for you. Me and my boys will take some others. Fun time. Oh, yeah. We're gonna definitely have a fun time, all right. Let's get to work.
think it's time to go on the roof for this. Four little goons over there. This is gonna be a little fun. Come on, just peep your... There we go. Hmm. Yeah. Looks like I got them for breakfast. I know this part is not bugged, but is that one, so I have to save it. this corner is going to be bugged. So I'm going to save it right there. I'm going to have to play the... Looky here. Just strolling into Disciple Turf. You're making this too easy. Look, I just don't want no trouble. Yeah, right. Why should I believe you? <laughs> Nobody... Trying to be mm. maybe mm. Ah, yeah. yeah. Everyone, let's go. Yeah, this is why it's bugged because there is no one here. So luckily this part I could just convince them and I can still complete the mission. No, it's just that one over there. Die. 
is why I carry some band-aids. This was a very quick and clean fight. Bodies are dead. Let's sell the cookie crumble. <laughs> we got the guns, new fish. Went in, pop, 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 and the cash is ours. Yeah, and that's thanks to me and my new best mate. <laughs> Hit any problems on your patrol? Oh, uh, no. It was a cake yeah, walk. Same here. Little element of surprise and a few bullets. And then no worries. Everything's going according to plan, Briggs. Good. Now we hit them where it hurts. This warehouse is one of their main strongholds. Not going to lie. Taking it is going to be hard. Newfish, we wouldn't be here without you. What's the play? Go in guns blazing? We hold back? Let's rush in together. What hit them. You heard the plan. Let's do it. Oh yeah, time to fuck these people up. Take care of my pistol. Time is over. Downstairs now. Security. Aww. Damn it! I was just having fun. Well, at least let me just collect them, bitches. All right, all right, all right. Look, look. I'm putting the gun away. I'm putting the gun away. Yes, sir. May I talk to you? Neon security wouldn't know about what's going down. Please. Looks like you've done a bit of violence. A bit yeah. of murder. I did. Word is, all of this is due to you. Why are you messing around with my streets, huh? Uh. I was doing your job, you're welcome. The first thing about my job. Oh, really? So here's what's going to happen. Gang violence gets too noisy. 
That hurts the bottom line around here. No one affects the bottom line. Tell that to the Disciples. No. I want you to, Mr. Briggs. The Disciples have been pissing me off for far too long. So, your gang throws off Sewer Rat Blue and starts wearing neon security black. Or, you can be found face down in the streets. And you, say your goodbyes. Briggs is a smart lad. He'll make the right choice. Free to go as far away from here as you like. The further the better, in my book. Oh, okay, fine. Setting street rat against street rat is pretty elegant, right? Don't take too long. Time to onboard the new hires. Good you're here. Huddle up, gang. Is this for real? They want me to be a... a cop. Shit. We could get a real pad. Maybe even move out of Pepside? Briggs, I'm so in. After all we've done, Neon Security seriously will let that go? I don't see why not. Do you really think anyone cares who stabs who in Ebside? No. What's your take? It's almost too much to hope for. Yep. Anyone object to going for the deal? This is your chance. No one? Good. Really good. I'll give Owen the news. I can't say I was expecting this. Whatever god or gods we please to get you to help us, no, we'll be forever grateful. Just keep the space on. With resources and backup, the streets are going to be safer. It looks like the strikers are retiring. And here's your cut. Thank you. And I got a pistol. Appreciate it. All of us owe you. We'll never forget. I still don't know what to think. Yeah, real job again. <laughs> I can't believe it. Hey, at least you're working. Finally, I can leave this garbage dump. You guys did this? It's almost impressive. Almost. Alright, well, I'll be out of your hair. It ain't my fucking problem no more. That's your problem. Well, at least all the people are running. Just back in the streets now. We're gonna have to take the load off. Unfortunately. Alright, where do we need to go? Alright, let's go in here. Just go in here and sell some goods. Core Kinetics isn't the only game in town, you know. I've got more. I bet you do. So, how about you know I'll sell you a little something. You know what I'm saying. I got all this right here. Damn, all that loot. Hey, man. Ooh, this is nice, super. Take one of those. Ooh, one of these, so yeah, that's good.
Doors over that way. Tell you one thing, I really do need a place to stay. But unfortunately, we don't got that much. Manaya Adams was looking for someone discreet for a job. Apparently, I don't qualify. Were you just Well, let's go to the ship and maybe unload our cargo. Should I start doing that? It's still not enough to get out of this freedom hole. How much do I have? Still is, still is not enough. Nineteen something thousand credits is still not enough. I need more than that to get out of this fucking shithole. Okay. Let's see if we can just unload our cargo in here. Keep some weapons in here, why not? Ship. Damn, seems like we got some actual material right here, too. Shit, we can almost damn near build something. Problem is, we're gonna need a place to live. We can't live on this fucking shithole. Not in this place. Alright. Oh, yeah, I gotta sell this shit, too. I'll keep this. I'm selling all this garbage. Um. Keep this. this here keep the chunks all right first of all we're gonna need something valuable we need that Got our pistol, salt rifle. This got a bleed effect target. It's not a bad gun, but not the greatest gun. But I'll do take this laser rifle. I get that. Get that too. Still got a long way to go. To the shit. We'll put this to the end. Put this in the middle. We could have enough to build a spacesuit, but probably more than that.
And we definitely need a doctor. You're looking. What can Reliant Medical do for you? Let me look you over. Honestly, I'm surprised you're walking around like this. <laughs> okay. Ship shape? Of course. Got four med packs. We're gonna have to buy some beds. We don't need a lot of beds, we just need a few of them. Five will do. And bandages will take five. Probably take three. Stay away from Aurora before you get hooked. Shit, don't worry about that because I ain't trying to get no fucking help. Alright. Crimson Fleet is everywhere these days, spreading like a virus through the set of systems. They like to set up shop in old facilities, places abandoned in the colony. That way, they can strike anywhere. Yeah, that's true. Come on, time to head to the club. Not a fan of this kind of music, but the noise provides ample cover. I'm in town for business. My client leaves a mess, I clean it up. I'm an independent contractor, working for some very wealthy clients. They open deals, I close them. There might be. I originally came here to complete a business deal, but the client, in a fit of foolishness, decided to close on their own. Rather than dispose of the evidence properly, they left it in a warehouse. Real amateur stuff. So there are some loose ends that need tying, and I prefer a third party handle it. Would you be interested? Hmm. Well, that depends. Just make sure it was worth it. I'm giving you half of my usual fee, which, according to my clients, is a ransom three times over. But I'm worth every cred. You'll find the merchandise in a locker in the warehouse behind Neon Tactical. Gangs in Ebside often use that area to peddle their sunshine and lollipops, so if shit's pakaru, you'll have to improvise. Once you secure the merchandise, sell it to Coleman Lang at the Trade Authority, so it's part of their regular inventory. Return here when the job is done. Sounds easy enough. Damn, 
damn, bro. Can you move the fuck out of the way? Nigga, you need to take that goofy ass hat off. Can you believe that? This nigga is wearing a goofy ass hat. Take that shit off, Kai. Hi. Having fun? No, I'm not having fun. Got too many people walking in here. I don't know where the hell they're going. Goofy ass nigga came in there with a fucking goofy ass hat. Like, nigga, you not Andre 3K? This is gonna be interesting. Private sector. Now that's where the real money's at. All right, well. Ah. <sighs> This is gonna be interesting. Welcome, off worlder, to the Hotel Bullseye. Your home away from home here. Let me put it up to the their next fix. A petition has reached 100,000 signatures. Stay out of trouble. Here in Neon, you visit the rarefied tree top right now. Welcome, off worlder, to the Just check something if the boss is still working. Nope, it's not working. Just have to reset it. I'd be making a fortune if they let us fish. I'll play through it without the mods. Damn, everybody's running around. Bro, like chill. This is the spot. Yeah. You just gonna stand there, or do you have something to say? No, I got nothing to say to you. They already took care of these motherfuckers. Okay, uh, this is easy. Let's see, what was it? Damn pistol. Oh, great. I'll be using that too. God, we took a good care of them earlier. This is just like a little cakewalk. No, please, not me. Oh no, run! Yeah, I might have to restart the game so. Better not be a waste of my time. This is some business. Some money. Mm. 
Not a bad gun. Good balance. Weight? Allied Armaments is a UC company, but their stuff is military grade. But that is not the issue here. That gun is hotter than a frying pan full of fish grease. I'm not giving you anywhere near market rate. Pleasure doing business with you. Heck of a day. Absolutely. You got the money. I'm gonna see if we still got the gun. This wasn't the gun. This was like literally a side star with like 32, but I don't even see it in here. Damn. Damn, he sold that shit off quick. So that shit off quick. God damn. You done here? Time to move on. Reunion Industries is looking really dumb. Not interested. Well, at least I tell at least I'm gonna tell her like, hey, I got it done. Have you tried one of our advanced teller machines? The Albank ATMs are still in the The Syndicate's been pretty bold lately. That'll work itself out. Damn. Every time you come into that club, you already know it's popping. It was a simple little cakewalk. You could have got it done. Fine Aurora heightens the senses. I prefer to sharpen them. Then my client can finally relax. He's a very tense man, you see. Tried to smile once years ago and didn't like the fit. But I digress. Here's your payment as promised. Enjoy the rest of your time here in Neon. It's the world's most exotic accident. They found the drug in the fish oil, of all things. But oil is an old story, one of grease and flame. The grease turns the wheels of commerce, and the flame attracts the moths. So be careful walking these streets, my delicate little insect. Venture too close, and you'll burn your wings. Always a pleasure. I'm gonna have to reset this um, game, but it's gonna be a cut, so I'll be right back.
All right. Now. All right. Now I am back. Just resetted it, so should be okay. So I'm about should be back. Now. job a shame we won't work together again do you have any more jobs for me i never work with the same client twice call it a personal role yes but i never work with the same client twice call it a personal role oh come on you know you got some work for me goodbye Oh, damn. I thought me and you we might have a beautiful friendship. Let's see how it is. Alright, let's get out of here. Hey, smuggler. I miss you. Ooh, man, you got some valuable weapons. Holy shit. Shit, man. You are way out of my price range. Holy fuck. Damn, man. Can you get me into the 2000 ring? God damn, bro. Almost ready to spend my whole paycheck away. Damn, legendary? Damn, how much this shit costs? Ooh, got a black one? Shit. I really like this. Oh, man. Mm, does a cinerary damage? Ooh, I have to scoop me up that, yo. Mm, this is acid. Damn, my friend, yo, you be smuggling some good shit. Hot headed. Damn, I might have to spend four grand on that, too. Spend all that. Yeah, I'll give you what I can sell you. Sell you this. Taking that. Bloody affair involving. Thanks, smuggler. Appreciate it. Let me 
Parasite Strikers battling with their nemesis, the Disciples, in a large warehouse. Many gang members perished in the violence. Might as well work with Eugen Industry. If I can start making some money there, then I can might get out of make enough money to get out of this fucking hellhole. Shop application. Work experience. How many years of experience do you work? familiar you oh shit look they got a college master's degree no nah, I just graduated out of high school you have any history uh criminal activity um Yes, I mean, of course. I mean, shit. I, this is neon. <laughs> and it's always been criminal activity. I can't lie about that. I didn't make the mission active. Oh, fancy suits. Welcome to the Ryujin Industries product store. Look, I'm stocked up on all of. What you got? Well, you know what? I'm gonna need me a fancy suit. Might as well get this suit. This, look, this looks good. Bye bye. You know, I gotta, I gotta look good for my job interview. Shit, man. Oh, man, my bad. I gotta sell some of this shit too. Holy fuck. I still got this trash. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah. Like plenty of good stuff. Damn. Am yeah, I making your fucking ass bored? Here, I'm, I got some stuff I can sell you, bro. Here, here's some of this. Here's some of that. 
this over this. And here is this uh syndicate suit, whatever this is bullshit ass suit. It's trash. It's not even fit my color. See you next time. Shoot, I'll see you next time. I'm gonna be up in the top. Fill, fill. I fill up that application. See, man, I might got that job interview. Feel me? Welcome to Reugent Industries. Can I help you? Yes. You must be one of the candidates that Imogene Salzo is interviewing today. Yep. Her office is down the hallway to my left. Take another left at the conference room, follow it around to the right and up a small flight of stairs. Then take a left and keep heading that way until you see her office. Sounds like a maze, right? So if you want me to walk you back there or have any questions, just let me know. I'm pretty good. Um, I do have and some questions. Hopefully, here. I have some answers. Uh, um, Between you and me, I think Imogene is about done with the whole process. You won't believe the people we've been getting. I heard the hiring algorithm Yuko made approved all applicants. And of course, Yuko bailed when interview time hit. It's technically her job. And Imogene is furious. Oh, shit. Imogene Salzo is my idol. She's ruthless, but still knows how to behave around everyday people, if you know what I mean. She's probably next in line to take over for Ularu Chen. Head of operations here, which would be a godsend considering Chen has no filter and loves to speak her mind. No one loves brutal honesty that much. Shit. Oh, wow. You're serious? Well, Ryujin is the tech industry leader in the settled systems, mostly known for neuroamps, which exploded on the scene about 15 years ago. Other than that, our products include operating systems, security, various quality of life improvements for the home. We're like a full package. If you really want more info, I'd recommend reading up at one of the kiosks. They've got this company's entire history listed. At least the history they want you to know. Good. Best not keep Imogene waiting too long. And the offer still stands if you need someone to show you the way. I can find it for myself. Well, good luck then. I'm sure I'll see you on your way out. Okay. Oh, it's a really nice building. Very fancy. I bet you it costs like tens if not billions of fucking dollars to make this place. I'm a little busy right now. Yeah, but I ain't fucking talking to you. Shit. Security guard is top notch. God damn. So crazy. Okay. I hope you're more prepared than the last one. Have a seat. Well, you could call me. Rep Pair, but I'm mostly All here right, for this. just to get a few things straight here, I'm Imogen Salzo, senior operations specialist here at Ryujin Industries. I don't normally do this, but my counterpart Yuko is indisposed at the moment, so here I am. We're looking for someone to fill an entry level administrative position. Apparently, our algorithm has failed us and believes you to be a decent match. Which I'll take up with our technicians later. So, let's get this over with. Why do you want to work for Ryujin Industries? What is it? I think I found something. But it turns a bit. You have that? It's always nice to see the local residents take an interest in us. This next one should be interesting, considering you marked having zero experience. Why do you consider yourself qualified for a job like this?
A bold answer. And hopefully one with truth behind it. Yeah. How motivated are you to succeed? All in, huh? At least that's an attitude we can work with here. And finally, my last question. If you worked here for five years, what role would you see yourself in? Five years. That's a lofty goal, and one I'd love to see you accomplish, but we'll soon be the judge of that. So look, since there's a million other things I'd rather be doing than this, not to mention that this isn't even my job, you're hired. Right. On a probationary period, of course. Especially considering this criminal record of yours. First order. There's a meeting starting soon, and I need you to pick up the coffee order at Terra Brew. Fairly easy. So you shouldn't be able to screw it up. If there's a line, skip it. Tell them you're here for Imogene Salzo, and you should get served right away. Sounds easy. Pretty much I'm gonna be her bitch. She just wants me to bark like a dog and whack my little fucking tail. Yep, just like the bitch she is sitting there. She's saying, go, play fetch, and go get my fucking coffee while I'm whacking my fucking little tail off. Like a bitch. Oh, might as well play fucking make-believe. Let's make- let's play make-believe I believe in myself to be this fucking dog. This dog is about to walk all the way down here to go fetch a bitch some coffee. That's some shit. Shit, I might as well pick up the coffee myself. Quit staring. Perfect marriage. Who the fuck is staring at you? And welcome to Terra Brew. Oh, the reunion order. You must be new. What happened to Tomo? Did he finally get that promotion? I got fired is what happened. And this is the soulless suit they got to replace me. Tomo, I'm sorry. I know how hard you were working for that promotion. Four years behind a desk, getting coffee, kissing up to that high and mighty Ularu Chen just to get replaced by this nobody? I'm just gonna pretend like it's not my problem, kid. Hearing that ad should have been the first sign they were gonna get rid of me. I bet Ularu was just waiting for the moment to hire you. And now that I've been terminated, it's only a matter of time before they send you after me. So I'm taking matters into my own hands! Oh, Believe me, it. it's either you or me! Come on, man. Are you serious? <laughs> Bro, I wasn't even prepared for this fight. You don't just get to learn all the ins and outs of Ryujin operations and then just walk away! Even worse, I got fired! <laughs> They don't let that kind of knowledge run around in the head of disgruntled employees. It's just a matter of time before they send you after me. So, I'm taking matters into my own hands! Um... I'll make this quick! I'll make this quick! Secret techniques of ancient Earth. Each of our baristas undergoes enhanced training. Sorry I have to do this, buddy. The best coffee anywhere in the galaxy. Take this and your coffee too. Right now. 
Yeah, might as well take your alpha too while I'm at it. Damn, I got a spacesuit too? Wow, you are very generous. Appreciate it. Damn, gave me a fucking free suit. <laughs> wow, appreciate it, bro. I'm sorry about that. I didn't really mean to do Well, this. that just made my day more interesting. Look, I don't want any trouble, but I'd get fired if I didn't call security to get this body out of here. So I'd head back to Ryujin ASAP and let Miss Salzo know if I were you. Oh no, what happened? I grew up on the Ebb side, so stuff like this is pretty common. Oh. Although it doesn't make it any easier to witness. Believe me. Sorry. Told you, it's not my fucking problem. Well, before I bring that up there, might as well go bring some of the shit to the ship. At least the space shoot. <laughs> I'm bringing that shit back to the back to the fucking ship before I bring this bitch her coffee. Shows me to sit there, and wag that tail, bitch. I'm taking the scenic route. Is either you or me? Hey, bro, calm down, man. What's going on? They won't just let you go. Four years I was getting this promotion. Four fucking years. And I've been replaced? Jesus fucking Christ. Four years you haven't done shit. That's what happened. Four years you haven't done anything. Alright, it's time to put away some of this shit. That's gonna come with me. That's gonna stay on the ship. And all I just need is a jetpack. Like that. It's a nice shirt, too. It's great. Luckily, I was quick, you know. <laughs> Luckily, I was quick on the stab. I was like, mm, mm. "Stab the fuck out of that dude!" I was like, "Boy, you ain't running up on me when I'm in the fucking coffee shop." I know you're supposed to not bring a knife to a gunfight, but in Starfield, there's a little bit of delay, so I have a chance to kind of run up on him with a knife. I know I wasn't prepared, because I didn't have my fucking gun drawn. So I would have been fucked. Just one bullet of that, I, I would have been dead. Now well, let's go up there and bring this off the terror. I think I got them. What do you call them? All your hectic thing Nigga, you still wearing that hat? Bro, with that goofy ass hat, you better take that shit off, man. That shit look goofy as hell, bro. You do not look cool up in this shit. 
Try to act like this motherfucker is about to shop in this place. Bro, take that goofy ass hat and walk your ass back to the fucking... <laughs> walk your ass back to the fucking sleeping bag outside, bro. Go, go rent those crates, bro. Go rent a crate. Sleep your ass there. Think about your outfit. That shit was the worst looking outfit I've ever seen in my life. Okay, I'm back. Oh, you're fancy. I guess you're sitting here all nice and clean. I'd hate to be on Miss Olzo's bad side. Hmm. Me too. Just look at this. This bitch is looking out the fucking window, wagging, wagging her finger at me with her arms crossed. All this bullshit. Let me stop talking shit. Here you go. Look, I brought you coffee. It's still hot considering the time it took you to get it. You either need to learn this city or how to deal with distractions. So, what was the holdup? Well, I guess one of your ex-employees, you know, ran up on me, motherfucker. Good answer. And the one I was hoping for since we learned of the incident before your return. Your handling of the Tomo situation has caught some attention. And we'd like to try you out in a different role at the company. And since Yuko isn't here to object, your new position starts right now. So, wow, congratulations. Thanks. You've been promoted. Not bad for your first day, right? Wow. Just... <laughs> wow, bitch. Really just bringing some fucking coffee? Dang, I told you I'm going to run in this place. Of course. We believe in risk versus reward here. Yeah. I'm promoting you to junior operative. The position is a bit more complicated and completely confidential. Oh. Your main duty is to add influence when necessary to ensure success of the business. Any questions so far? Hmm. Confidential. Like any good corporation, we consider what we do here to be a trade secret. If others knew and could mimic our actions, it would take away our edge. Oh, good point. So basically you want me to just like go around and kill people and steal their little documents, huh? Alright, how do well, I suppose to job, really. If someone can't be persuaded with words, perhaps a more forceful approach is necessary? Oh. You're basically removing obstacles from the equation. Oh, basically I'm just your little muscle girl? I'm just your little muscle-bound girl. You're just gonna be like calling me up at like five in the morning, be like, "Oh, I got a problem. Come and move this thing out of my shop." In any case where a threat to success is established, one of us is sent out to create a more desired outcome. Oh. This may be through a conversation or presenting some new information. It's all very situational, as you'll soon see. All right. Well. Hey, as long as I kill motherfuckers and rob their bodies and I collect and I collect two hundred dollars and go, I'm pretty much golden. Just don't really? treat me bad. Well, this transition may be easier than I thought. Now, let's get that coffee delivered. I'll gladly take mine. And since Yuko's still a no-show, feel free to keep hers. The other recipients are eagerly waiting for you in the conference room. Alright. Um, thanks, I guess. I get to meet the little fucking circle jerks. Oh, God. Shit. Might as well eat something before I even head in that bitch. <laughs> For real. Might as well eat a little snack. Drink a little coffee. Drink this too while I'm at it. Give me all a hype up. Alright, here we go. Happy face. Hey, how you guys doing? I'm Junior Executive Leadership Role. How you been? Hold on, let me introduce myself. What's your name? You'd think we'd want to support our own subsidiary and get tranquility more often, but Terra Brew it is. Terra Brew would be as current projections are set to surpass Terra Brew within the next five years. Tea talk aside, allow me to introduce myself. I'm Lyndon Calderi, Chief Financial Officer. 
I'll be the one deducting expenses from your pay every time you manage to screw up. Which, from the sound of it, might be often. Shh, ain't gonna be often, I said. Well, there goes my paycheck. <laughs> well, there goes my fucking paycheck. We'll see. We've yet to have an operative with a perfect record. This introduction was not annoying. I hope our future encounters are as productive. Just it will be. Ooh, how's you? Looking pretty. Imogene said she hired someone new. I'm Genevieve, head of marketing and public relations. Nice to meet you. Likewise. Anyway, it's good to put a face to the new operative. The only question now is how much work are you going to be? A few slip-ups are to be expected. Just know that one screw-up for you means a lot of overtime and sleepless nights for me and my team. So, any precautions you can take will be greatly appreciated. I'll try my best, beautiful. Don't worry. I won't screw it up. Yeah. Going around the table, bro. Coffee, finally. Damn. Well, let's have a look at you. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so... If only pleasure was the word for it. I'm Alexis Price, head of the legal department here, and I'll be direct. Any legal troubles you cause as an operative, witnesses getting arrested, are my troubles. Oh, shit. So steer clear of law enforcement. We may have connections with Administrator Bayou and the Free Star Rangers, but they aren't the ones I prefer to abuse. I bet you do. Okay. Let's hope your best is good enough. Let's hope the fucking job ain't gonna be fucking hard. How about that? Just make it easier for so, me. So, fetching coffee one minute, and junior operative the next. I know, Good right? Show. Supply chain manager for Ryujin. We won't work together much, but as part of the same department, hopefully I'll be seeing you around. Good to meet you. Yeah, it's always nice to fit names to faces. And we rarely see most of the operatives around here. Anyway, welcome to the team. Oh, and just a heads up, people in your position don't typically see the brighter side of Ryujin Industries. But rest assured, this is a great company. And the work we do goes toward benefiting millions. Please do. Yeah. It's easy to get wrapped up in the bad if that's all you see. I just lied to that fucking shit. I honestly don't believe go. it. Just keep an open mind. Oh, huh. and thanks for the coffee. Yeah, I'll definitely keep that a fucking open mind. All right, well... Nice to meet you guys. So hopefully I'll be working with y'all guys in the future. And I'll be taking my leave and thank you very much. And I hand you all your coffee. So you can start your little circle jerk meeting while I deal with the bitch with their hands crossed and waggling her tail. I have a deadline. Look, don't worry. I'm not holding your ass up. You could just keep going. I got to deal with this one right here. <sighs> okay. Round two. Why, hello. I see all your little friends in there. I, I meet them. Your little meet and greet. Oh, I, I did. To know the execs who you'll be impacting while on the job. Oh. Oh, that's great. So basically, I just had a little coffee and tea with them and their little talk. They said one fuck up for me is just going to be hanged from my fucking neck. That's the best way you could put it. But let me just be I nice to you. Imagine. I know. Now that you've met a few of the execs, let's get you started. We have reason to believe that our friends at Kelt Corp are trying to hack into our R&D server, since we're both competing for a contract right now. I suppose an outsider might think that. But we'd prefer to handle incursions like this in-house. Uh, we can't allow them to win the contract, nor can we allow the action to go unpunished. I'll be giving you a data slate with a file that you'll need to upload through one of their computers. Oh, great. So basically do some thing. I can Remember, it done. This is confidential. We can't have anyone at Kelcorp getting suspicious. 
when all is said and done, it should be as if you were never there. Here's the data slate. Good luck. Great. I have to wag my tail and do this shit for your ass. Well, she has a little fucking little pet little meeting while I go ahead and play a little little game called Sneak in the Office and Upload a Virus. Alright. Well, this is gonna be a little fun. There's no killing on this one. Don't want to dress up like a Ryujin industry. I dress casual for this one. Let's get the knife for this one. Tell you one thing, I'm ready to get out of this shithole. Hamza kept pestering me about his damned missing slate. Like security's got time to track something like that down. <laughs> missing slate? Sounds interesting. That's something for me I can spend some time with. I'm almost I gonna. His power kept going out. Know what it was? I heaved leech as long as my leg. Yuck. Well, I dealt with the part. Before I deal with them. Thank you. Welcome to Kelt Core. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I sent along the credits to my father and convinced him to excuse all of the late penalties. He was a bit more reasonable about it than I expected. As for Saburo and I, we're working closer than ever before. On a plan together. For his business. To get it back on track, I mean, he really is a lovely man. Probably one of the most honest in this... Godforsaken city. It'll be my pleasure to help him get back on his feet. I bet. Tough city. You watch yourself out there.
I spy three, and this will lead you to. Simple as that. Nice and easy. Well, you have a good day, ma'am. I'll be seeing you around. I'll be talking to him real soon. Make some credits off of him. That was easy as one, two, and three. Got a problem? Do I look like I got a fucking problem? Yo, Neon be rough, bro. Bro. Shit. It reminds me of New York, but even worse. Apparently, Saburo's Shit, this is almost worse than Brooklyn. God damn, what the fuck is that outfit? Girl, you need to go home and take off that motherfucker outfit. That look crazy. Ah uh, damn shit, man. Shit, her outfit look crazy as hell. She needs to take out that whole outfit, bro. She does not. That shit does not look good. My brother, your hair is fucked up. You need a haircut. Nigga, you don't even have a watch. Go get a haircut. That dude need a fucking haircut for real. Shit. I don't know who his mama is, but yo, his hair, he needs to go to a white barbershop, yo, to get that hair done. <laughs> for real. <laughs> he needs to go there. That shit look crazy. All right, I'm back. Gotta pretend like I'm working here. Oh. Isn't bad, but you're going to need more supporting evidence. Imogen's a stickler for details. And that's what I was afraid of. I just hate accessing the Combatech database. It's anxiety-inducing. I know what you mean, but that's your missing piece right there. All right, I'll get on it. I hate being stuck in the office. Imogene told me she hired another operative. Welcome to the team. I'm April. I can't speak for what every operative does. Uh, people tend to keep their cards close to the chest in operations. But me personally, I'm a field agent. I specialize in gathering intel that our techs can't get. Especially blackmail material on high-profile clients and execs. Most assignments take me to the Astral Lounge or Paradiso. It's an incredible job. Great perks, too. I spend most of my time undercover living in luxury. It's great, as far as I'm concerned. I have a lot of respect for Imogene. She's not afraid to take what she wants. <laughs> and hates paperwork as much as I do. But what I like the most? She trusts us to get things done. None of that micromanaging crap. Good luck with your future assignments. Yeah, good luck to you. So, you need a you need some makeover. I'll tell you that much. All that other cover shit, I I think you you need a whole makeover. So, I don't look like a goddamn crackhead. Oh, hey, how you doing? Yeah, well, look who survived their first assignment. How'd it go? Um, it, 
No, it went perfectly well. It went well. Glad no to hear it. To report. Not a single setback. <laughs> no. I knew you were going to be perfect for this job. If you recall, setbacks mean a lot of things for a lot of people. Payoffs, cover stories, cleanup crews. You get my drift. The cleaner your work, the more intact your payments stay. I'm sure you understand. Yeah, I get it. So, you've gotten caught in the past. Now's the time to make new habits. In the meantime, I'll make sure that slate is properly disposed of. So, now that we know you're capable of handling some light cyber mischief, let's try your hand at a little uh, framing. Framing? What the fuck is that? <laughs> and I'd argue that arts and crafts is exactly what we do here. Just on a much higher level. Wow. One of our subsidiaries, Arboron, is currently competing for a contract against Laredo. Now, the buyer likes to keep their associations clean, and will be sending a representative to Laredo in Aquila City for an evaluation. We just need you to visit their office first, and accidentally leave behind some incriminating evidence against their company. Ooh. Wow, you're really making it a solid one. That's the motivational mentality our executives love to hear. Mm -hmm. Here's the slate we need you to plant. It holds confidential files that'll cast the perfect negative light on our friends at Laredo. Now, get going. Uh. Yes, ma'am. Well, seems like now I can get the fuck off of this rock. Might as well start getting collecting like a little like hole or something actually. This would be a perfect opportunity after this little job. Alright. Um I already got the spacesuit and I got that and I got some weapons. We still got two problems here. For one, I'm gonna need a jetpack. Two I'm gonna need a partner for this. Because I can't do missions by myself, especially out there in the open it's too much. I'm definitely gonna need some backup. Because for starters, you're going to need, I'm gonna need somebody in here that I can trust. <sighs> problems after problems after problems. More money, more problems. Alright. Strategy time. Current data shows revenue has decreased 13.7 percent. Yeah, so business sucks. Tell me something I don't know, Sticks. Affirmative. If it were a miracle, the first to a bottle of toothpaste, please. Let's see what we got. We got 20,874 credits. Now. We do need a jetpack for sure. So might as well go to the trade at the release. Need something? Always See happy to you take your money. <laughs> I bet you you do. I'm always happy to do some business. Why not? It's only fair. This is the best you've got. This ain't good enough for me. If you uh, find anything else, make sure you bring it to me. Yeah. Well, whenever you get some better shit, let me go over here and maybe ask him and see what you got. You may got some goodies. I don't know. New Will's goods. I had to chase more zone heads out of here today. I don't think they even knew what planet they were on. Welcome to Newell's. 
If you're looking for any specific goods, Rosa and I guarantee we'll beat Sieghart's l Oh, I don't have a... That man, he skips merchant meetings and refuses to participate. Yeah, sure. Every payment secret. Anyway, sorry. My, if you'll forgive the outburst and have. Let me just like get something. No problem. I'm sure you'll find something you like. Say, looks like a bunch of little outbursts. All right. Well, it seems to me this is the best they have, so I might as well take it. Only nine hundred. Tell everyone you know about our store. Dual's Goods has a full line of equipment and accessories for all your hectic needs. And we're gonna have to hire one person with us. I already think I know the perfect candidate for that. Second a chat? I'm in the market for a job that'll get me out of neon. If you need some muscle on your crew, I might be your girl. Man, am I glad to hear that. Thank you so much. So before we finalize anything, I should probably tell you that I'm a member of the disciples. If that changes your mind, I get it. Not everybody likes associating with gangs. I killed their gang, so pretty much they're on the brink of retirement anyway, so the security is taking care of them. They don't need to. One of Neon's biggest gangs. We mostly operate in Ebside, like the Strikers. No, 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 of course not. I wouldn't involve you in any kind of trouble. The gang's leaders know I'm planning to take a contract job off world. Thanks. That's a big relief. You wouldn't wow. be the first person to turn me down when they found out. <sighs> I'm glad I got that off my chest. Now, if you don't mind, I'd like to discuss my salary. Loyal service doesn't come free. Not when I have debts to pay off. I'll accept your standard going rate, not a credit less. Okay. As long as you aren't trying to screw me. I know. Okay. Hold on. I never said that was my final offer. <sighs> okay, fine. I'll take it. Something's better than nothing. Okay. Yeah. Works for me. I'm ready to start whenever. Good. Well, you're gonna be on my ship. Right. I have a couple things to sort out here, then I'll head to my post. This is going to be fantastic! 
I've been waiting my entire life to get out of Neon. So long, Captain. No problem. I am zoned out of my mind right now. <laughs> Probably gonna have to buy another weapon or two, I'll tell you that much. Crazy how she's with the she's with the disciples, but yet she's hanging out. She's right I think she doesn't know where she is, but at least at least it's better than she's better than being on the streets. I tell you that much. But she seems like a good person, so might as well. We're gonna need Looking some to weapons. Blow a hole on something. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Feel like bringing the pain, huh? Oh, yeah. We're gonna definitely blow a hole or two. Hmm. Damn, this is a nice-ass gun. Oh, my God. Shit. Ooh. Damn. Shit, I'm almost ready to get this gun right here, bro. Well, you got some higher prices. Maybe I should start investing in a sniper rifle this time around. I do got I do got a submachine gun for it too. This is a really nice weapon too. And with a silencer. But I think it's time to start investing in a sniper rifle. Get that long range shot. Kill people from a distance. I don't need that much. I just need a hundred. Just to start off. Goal point. Sticks, how's this month looking? I'm sorry, I did not understand your query. Right. Might need to bring some medical supplies too while we're at it. I don't start moving on. Hello. Hope you're feeling well today. I, can use I trust you'll put this to good use. Take three more of this. Healing pace. Probably gonna take ten hours. This is one. Three of those. Might have to go on a mini little expedition. If you need help, remember Reliant. Good luck, Doctor, because I'm out of here. I'm taking flight. Save it for someone who gives a damn. It's time to get off of this dumbass place. Time to get off of this dumbass place.
we're gonna do this mission first, and then after that, we gotta go. Before we go, we might as well start changing the pink color on it, because it does not look good. I don't want that fucking color. Anything I- You should inspect your ship for heat leeches every- Okay, no problem. Out of here, getting the fuck out of neon. You see that? I came with nothing. I came with shit. Now I made something out of myself. Fuck up out of here. Tell this dumbass planet. Before I do it. We should start putting some points into this. Might as well put some piloting. Just stick with this and security. some of these items on the ship. Ready for takeoff? Yes, we are. Speed temperatures. Let's see what we gotta do. Where do they want us to go? Cuba City? Well, then again, there's that Tracker Alliance, too. And some other goodies. Hmm. <laughs> Go 
going to Oceana City. It's out of range, so I'm gonna have to stop over here. So we run on. Indeed, freeze. I'm not even gonna survive on that. something over here. Let's check it out. question is, should I go over here and do this outpost? The temperature is deep freeze. Let's just add to it, fuck it. 
like can find some extra Is it really the problem inside? No, it's pretty good. Might as well risk it. Oh shit, she's looping.
Need me? Sure, I... Send the trace of you for a while. Get to it. I'll give this one to her. She can have that one. We're gonna have to find some more weapons up there. Take only five of these. Heal pace. Five. Mobilizer. Even though it's low gravity, just in case I'm taking two. Packs. We'll take all mine. Take one of these. I was just wondering where you'd gone. You got it, Cap. Hey, what's up? Ooh, got some. I got something for you. My nice little gift. A gift that keeps on giving. Nah, I'm only gonna give you one bullet of that. Because you gotta make 50 bullets out of it. Captain. Let's save it. So then that way when we die, put it back here. I bet a miner like you feels right at home among all these rocks. We got a mission. Our mission is this one. We don't want to be out here too long. We just need to get inside.
want to get burnt to death. Take a house for room, room shit. Might as well. It's the cinderary rounds that we got from Neon. Man, this just comes in handy. Love it. Ages. Got some, we got something both we got in common. I'll give you a grenade, and you can definitely use it. Well, I have one grenade. I'll take one thing. It's just like some house room zealots. Might as well.
take a shit. That's my suit. It's a basic suit. This is why I like this is why I like to go on missions like this. It's called expedition. Find shit. Find shit is ours. a lot, you idiot. to just clear up the building first. And we'll grab all the loot after. Two shot at me? Fuck. Fuck my life. Fucking shit just two shot at me. Oh my god. Hold on. Alright. We're gonna have to really... We're gonna have to really strategize on this shit. The fucker just two shot at me. 
you did the fucking two step.
pop out your little dumbass head. Are you serious? Holy shit. God damn. Alright. So we know what to do. the way. So fucking close. <laughs> so fucking close. God damn it.
swear to God. I swear to God. Oh my God. Fuck. <laughs> ah, fuck. I can't help but laugh. Let me load that again. I fucked up there. Damn, bro. That that last part right up there is going to be the hardest fucking shit to do. I'm gonna have to probably save that shit right up there, so when I get up there, I'm gonna have to save it. There's a lot more music in this game. Let me see. I'm gonna have to improvise on this.
die. Damn it. Oh, this is going to be so hard. Not giving up until I fucking beat this shit. <laughs> baby fucking did it piece of shit piece of shit Sue is not even all that special bitch right, time to grab this shit and let's get the fuck up out of here
button on here? Switch. Time to grab all the loot and get the fuck up out of here. Time to go. Here, get the fuck up out of here.
myself real quick. That shit gets worse. Took me a couple of times I died, but hey, I finally managed to get it. Gotta be a little bit aggressive. Yeah, we're not even, I don't even think I'm prepared to do a expedition. I will need a lot more gear and stuff like that to do it. space. Please hold your current speed and heading while we scan you for contraband. Watch that. And that's it. Enjoy that Aquila City, eh? Yeah?
Maybe I should do some other little missions around Aquila City, do some expeditions. So I'll level up my character. Save it. We're just going to put in this game. Alright, that's it for me, bro. Oh man, that took a lot out of me. Holy shit. Fucking died so many times like fuck. Bro, if it's not one thing, it's just an explosion. I swear. At least I got it in there. But hopefully you guys do enjoy the video. Make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe. And until next time, I'll see you guys on the next live stream. Peace.